Well, hello everybody. This is Street Alt Laws No Prep Talk. That I'm going to talk about Jim House new No Prep Kings car, the Guardian 2.0. Now, photo goes directly to their photo owners. Please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Street Alt Laws No Prep Gangs race series and all the other Street Alt Law shows. So, it's been roughly two months since Jim wrecked or had his incident in the Guardian. 1.0 car or the original guardian actually now they were running it pretty good the car i believe was number three in points in the invitational main event points this year and then he crashed he drove the gtr for two races but now he has the new guardian car ready for idaho it's been finished and it's pretty much a brand new build I don't know if they're actually reusing parts from the original car, but it's mostly a brand new build. So uh, this car should promise to be a lot faster than the original one, and the original one was already one of the fastest cars on NPK. It definitely terrorized everybody back in Season 5, and in Season 6 it was doing really good as well. So... Uh, Let's see what happens with this new car, but I do believe it will be faster than the original one, and it's going to be faster than the GTR. So, uh, Jim Howe, I'm sure he did some changes to it, and it's going to be one really fast No Prep Kings car, and very, very competitive for sure. Now, he does have a brand new motor for it that he just built. It supposedly will make more power than the previous combination that he ran in the Guardian, and more power than the combination that is in the GTR. So he needs more power because he did get outran a couple of times by Damon and some other cars, but the original Guardian was really fast. It's been 370s to the eighth. It went 570s to the quarter mile. So definitely very capable car. And he has this brand new motor combination that promises to make a lot more power. So they will be running it this following weekend at Idaho, Firebird Raceway. The air in Idaho is really bad, especially for a blower car or an nitrous car, but allegedly they were testing the car today and I'm sure it's gonna be dialed in perfectly for the Idaho race and the following NPK races. Now last season, Jim missed five races, I believe, and he still ended sixth in the main event point standings at the end of the season. So it would not surprise me if John and Jim, because John is quite a bit behind right now, make a really good run towards the end of the season. And hopefully they will do good at the next following races. So let's see how the car looks in Idaho. We haven't seen any pictures of it. Only a first picture that I posted of the dash. But they have not released any other pictures just from the motor combination that's going in it. So it's going to be a big surprise on the reveal this next weekend in Idaho. So let's see what happens.